Capital Transport employs over 350 employees and, and has engaged over 1,600 subcontractor uh, transport drivers. We've grown pretty substantially since we were formed in 1996 and obviously grown across the country in that time as well. So we've got locations in uh, Melbourne, Sydney, Brisbane, Adelaide and Perth and we service um, around 8,000 clients doing around 8,000 jobs every day. From a finance perspective, we had grown so rapidly but our finance processes had more or less stayed the same since we were a smaller business and we were using a, a small software package uh, and, and we were really running the business using a lot of Excel spreadsheets and manual processes. We had a, you know, an immediate mandate to Im implement a new ERP system to be able to facilitate the next stage of growth in the business because we were already you know, ex expanding beyond the capability of our current system. So we, we looked at uh, cloud and on-premise solutions when we were assessing which ERP we wanted to implement. By working closely with, with our IT team, we gained comfort that the security in place with WISE was really sufficient. We felt like with WISE that you know, being a product that was new to the market, supported by KPMG, Microsoft and Commonwealth Bank, you know, being um, you know, obviously very large um, organisations, that it was going to be supported long into the future. In particular, being you know uh, associated directly to a core Microsoft product, we felt like it was going to get the continual investment to to make it you know the best system it can be into the future. Some of the competitors that we were looking at, um, we we weren't confident that their systems were going to be in place or supported in the future, and that we might be forced to roll into other alternative softwares in the not too distant future if we went with them. So it was good reason to go with Wise. Another reason to move to Wise was because of the user familiarity with the Microsoft product suite. So for instance, you know, ribbons like in Microsoft Word and Excel or Outlook were also the way that you know, WISE was, was laid out in a lot of ways. Um, it was very you know, seamless and, and user friendly. We needed to be mindful that you know, with our existing staff um, transitioning and also with new staff, we wanted to be able to you know, make the ERP something that's easy to understand and easy to use for whoever is accessing it. My first impression was WISE is that the interface looked very user friendly. I could maneuver through the functions and ribbons quite easily uh, without having to go through the help guide. Uh, but eventually that ribbon also became very useful uh, because it answered a lot of basic questions that I had. With 20 companies, we have obviously got a lot of uh, inter-entity transactions, and quite a high volume actually. So one of the key things we were looking for in a system was the um, ability to post simultaneous transactions between the systems. So when you raise an invoice from one company to another in the group, it um, automatically can post in the other entity. So it's you know, halving the amount of time that you, you need there. So the use of dimensional tagging um, has benefited us you know, because we've been able to um, you know, create really granular level of information um, as we need it. So under the previous system we had, we were spending the best part of five days preparing management reports. That's come down to one or two, so we're saving three days per month. Transitioning to WISE has obviously freed up a lot of time for us. Uh, we, we were previously closing our management reports around the 20th of the month, more or less all month we were working around reporting. So the savings overall would be in the vicinity of um, 60, 60 to 100 days probably, you know, a third of somebody's time uh, which we've been able to redeploy. Previously I spent a lot of time um, data entering but now WISE have allowed me to analyse those numbers and provide insight and trend into the business. Choosing WISE wasn't just about choosing a system that did what we were currently doing, it was about choosing a system that was going to grow with us and had the capability to you know, take on you know, next things that we knew we needed in the future, so whether it be um, more capable um, procurement, uh, controls and automation in the, in the system that we might use in the future, we felt like it was uh, good for now and good for the future. So we don't expect to implement another ERP in, in certainly in my time here or maybe even my lifetime. <laughs>